Now, I know many people here are training to become pastors, Bible teachers, evangelists, and so forth. And many people watching and listening are likewise being trained for what we might call full-time Christian ministry. But you know that is not the only way of serving God. We are all in full-time Christian ministry, whether we are teachers or doctors, whether we work in our homes, whether we, whatever our job is, we are called by Jesus to go into the world to be living presences and living demonstrations of the kingdom of God, and in doing that, we will act as salt in the world. Secondly, we act as salt by our protests by speaking God's values, by standing up for right and for wrong, for resisting evil, speaking out against injustice, getting alongside those who are oppressed. Our God-directed protests against these things prevent decay, brings healing and purification. Who knows, in my words, Some of you are hearing a call to politics. We need Christian politicians. We need Christian economists. We need Christians in all of the professions, in all of the walks of life, in all trades and occupations. Yes? Thank God for Christian politicians who are standing right there in various countries in the world. I know of some of them. I won't divulge, but I know some of them where there's much persecution and there are Christian politicians behind the scenes who are working. I know of one society, one part of the world, where people can just print whatever they want to print in newspapers and it's mob rule. When the rabble is roused against a Christian ministry, they can just print on the newspaper, in the newspaper, whatever they want. Lies, lies and lies. And of course, there is the law of the land, which you can go through and have some form of legal redress, but the system is so unfairly set up against Christians because it's not a Christian society. Um, Well, uh, uh, I don't think there ever is a Christian society, not until the kingdom of God comes in its fullness. But what I'm saying is that society is dominated by another religion. 